to my bear. Ay. Right. Now, magpunta naman tayo sa food. Ano ka? <laughs> Is it alright? If I tell you some of my secrets I'm in over my head right now Think they're gonna wake up Yeah, boy, you're born. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Thank you. Let this out. Let this out now. Conversations I have with myself. A lot in here. Are you gonna propose again? Hello, hello, my lovely Chris. Happy birthday to you. You all cookie up. Look at her. Go. You're watching from Korea with love. Today's vlog is going to be an unboxing slash birthday haul. Actually, this vlog is long overdue because I had my birthday a few months ago. But it's just now that I have enough time to do this because I have to stay home for a week or two. Unfortunately, we have a COVID-19 case at the workplace, so I am in self-isolation. I had my test done and thank God I tested negative. But for everybody's safety as well as my safety, I'm gonna be staying in the house for a couple of days. So without further ado, let's start unboxing. Let's start with the smaller items. Dahil magsasummer nung nag-shopping ako, namili ako ng ilang sunglasses for me and for my husband. So the one that I got for him is a pair of Tom Ford sunglasses. It was actually one of my gifts for his birthday. Oh, nahulog ang card. <laughs> right, ito yung uh, guarantee card niya. By the way, I bought this one in Lotte Department Store. Nag-sale ang Lotte Department Store ng mga branded sunglasses. And dun ko binili halos lahat ng mga sunglasses na ipapakita ko sa inyo ngayon. So, ito yung klase ng sunglasses na gustong-gusto ng husband ko, aviator sunglasses. Nagustuhan ko din tong style ng sunglasses na to. So, I wanted to get one for me. But even with my Monet face, I think it's a bit big for me. Anyway, I saw one online similar to this one. So, I got that one. At ang ganda ng color, purple. My favorite color actually. But I had to return it because of a scratch dun sa lens niya. Now, let me tell you a little bit about returning items in Korea. In Korea, you have only 7 days to return an item. And when you return an item in Korea, you have to tell them the reason why you are returning it. So, hindi tulad sa ibang bansa, for example, in the US, na kahit ilang days na, pwede mo pa rin isoli yung item, right? Here in Korea, if it's damaged or defective, you can return it, no questions asked. But... If you're returning an item just because you changed your mind, most probably, if you ordered it online, you're gonna be paying for the shipment. Or uh, if you bought it from a store or a shop, uh, they're not probably gonna accept it. Kung yung reason mo lang ay, okay, nag-change mind ako, ganon. And there are some shops too, here in Korea, that won't accept returns. So, ito yung mga malaliit lang na stores sa, let's say, Myeongdong, Dongdaemun, or underground shopping centers. Especially yung mga murang items, or yung mga items na discounted or on sale. Hindi mo sila may sasoole. So, make sure kapag nabili ka sa isang maliit na shop dito sa Korea, na yung binili mong item na yon wala siyang any defects or damage, or hindi ka na mag-change mind. Next naman, yung para sa akin. Okay. Uh, medyo unfair, no? Kasi, isa lang ang binili kong sunglasses sa husband ko. Ako, bumili ako ng tatlo para sa sarili ko. <laughs> okay. Anyway, uh, unahin natin, itong... Sunglasses from Diesel. Nupunasan talaga bago isukat eh. No? Alright. Okay. Very nice color. Right? At napakagaan niya sa mata. This one naman is from a Korean brand called Metro City. Ang Metro City isa yan sa mga sikat na brand ng bags or um, accessories dito sa Korea. Okay, let me try this on. Alright. So, this one is in bronze or brown. Medyo hindi siya comfortable pagdating sa nose bridge. The clerk who sold me these sunglasses, uh, she told me that if the glasses are broken and they can be fixed naman, 
Pakita ko lang yung guarantee card uh, sa kanila and there is AS or in Korean we call it after service. Ito yung um, aayusin nila ng libre para sa'yo yung product na binili mo sa kanila. I want to show you the case that this Metro City sunglasses came with. So, ganito siya. It's very convenient to use. So, for example, uh, sinuot mo na yung sunglasses mo and you want to bring the case with you, you can fit this one in your bag. I-fold mo lang siyang ganun. And it's not gonna take up a lot of space in your bag. The last one is from Moncler. This is actually my favorite pair of sunglasses now because it, it's very comfortable to wear and the color is really nice. You've probably seen me wear this in some of my vlogs. Excited ko na siyang isuot eh, kaya inaraw-araw ko. <laughs> Bayan, may ume extra. You can stay there. Sige, I'm not gonna bother you. Sige lang, sige lang. Ang sa bags naman tayo. So, unahin natin yung mga malalaking bags. Hindi ako talaga mahilig sa mga malalaking bags. Pero, um, since most of my classes, ay, ano ba yan? Cookie, down ka muna, down, down, down. <laughs> unahin natin yung mga malalaking bags. Hindi ako talaga mahilig sa mga malalaking bags, but, Ay, excuse me, Cookie. Excuse me. Since most of my classes now are online classes, namili ako ng ilang uh, bigger bags na magkakasya yung laptop ko. Kasi sometimes dinadala ko yung laptop eh for my Zoom classes. Nag-sale ang Lacoste online and I got two bags, one for me and one for my mom. So, the one that I got for me is... A perfect summer color. Here it is. I'm saying this is a perfect summer bag because of the color. Diba? This is the Lacoste Small Vertical Tote in Mint. So, tignan natin kung kakasha ang aking laptop. Ay, cookie. Inupuan mo yung laptop. Excuse me, Donya. Wait lang. Excuse. Gulo talaga ni cookie. Alright, so... Tignan natin kung magkakasya yung laptop. Oh! Ah, may laman siya sa loob. Alright, tanggalin natin yung laman niya. Okay. There we go. Okay. So, the laptop fits to a tiny. That is good. This bag is the perfect size for my laptop. This bag is the one that I got for my mom. So this is the Lacoste Abstract Design Coated Canvas Shopper in White. Right? My story kung bakit white ang kinuha kong bag for my mom eh. Meron kasi akong binili sa kanya na white fossil bag. Pero nagustuhan niya ng mother-in-law ko. Kaya yun, na harbor. So I just got my mom a bag similar to that one. Same size, same color. It's just that this one has a lovelier design. So I think my mom is gonna love this bag. Ah, you're quick. I can see it. Move, come on and move. All right. Anyway, this one is from Kate's paid. Aray ko. <laughs> it's the Margareta Girl Street Tote in navy. Ginamit ko na to eh because I had a demo. I put some uh, stuff inside. <laughs> Mga Nespresso boxes. Kasi ayoko na mapit-pit yung bags. Alam nyo pag uh, napit-pit na yung bags or nagka-scratch na, ayoko na siyang gamitin. Masela na ko sa mga gamit eh. It's a structured bag na magaandalhin. But the problem is, hindi mo ma zip yung bag once na nilagay mo na yung laptop sa loob. So when I used this one, I just didn't zip it. Now, let's have the smaller bags. Unahin natin ang Michael Kors bag na ito. But this is really cute, right? What I love about this bag is that it looks like a Valentino with all the studs on the side. Diba? So I'm just gonna put the strap. So habang tinatanggal ko yung laman nito sa loob, gusto ko lang ichika sa inyo yung first time na nakasama ko mag-shopping yung isang family member na halos kasing edad ko din. I was also choosing a bag, a red bag, similar to this. And nung yun yung pinili ko, ang sabi niya sa akin, 
Why are you choosing a red bag? Hindi mo ba alam na dito sa Korea, red is for older people. So, dun ko nalaman na yung red na gustong-gusto kong kulay, pala ang kulay na mas prefer ng mga nakatatanda dito. And yung mga nakababatang Korean women, yung mga halos kasing edad ko lang, women in their 20s, 30s, 40s, they prefer black, white, navy, bags, even clothes, coats, paset mga neutral colors, ganon. Kapag nagsusuot ako ng mga brightly colored clothes at masyadong makulay yung mga accessories ko, ang sabi sa akin ng husband ko, para daw akong matanda. I don't really give a damn. It's the perfect size for a crossbody. Actually, mahilig ako sa mga crossbody bags kasi kapag namamasyal ako, Um, gusto ko lang dalhin yung phone ko, yung wallet ko. Meron pala siyang chain sa harap na ganito. I like this. Nakakadagdag siya sa kaatihan ng bag. The last bag is from Bokker. Sa lahat ng mga bags na pinamili ko, ito talaga yung excited kong i-open. Kasi ang ganda ng pagka-package niya, nakabox pa siya. Pag kasi bumibili ako ng mga bags dito na naka-sale na, wala na silang original box or sometimes pati yung original dust bag nila, wala na rin. Like this one, yung Kate Spade na bag na binili ko, iba na yung binigay na dust bag. If you don't want to spend so much money over a handbag, you may want to check Lotte Tops sa Lotte Department Store. Hindi lang bags meron sila doon. They also have branded shoes, sometimes branded clothes. So, wala akong mesa dito sa harap. So, I'm just gonna do this. Hopefully, you'll see it. Alright, there we go. Okay. Cookie's gonna be so happy kasi ang daming kalat <laughs> dito niyan after kung mag-unbox. And actually, nakahiga na siya dito sa mga paper bags and mga plastic bags. Maya, pakita ko siya sa inyo. Right? And mga boxes. Hinihintay niya yung mga boxes. Ano yung mga cats love na love nila yung mga boxes, right? Okay. Ang daming balot. Mm. This is another small bag. It's nicely made. Yung pagkasafiano niya, talagang pinong-pino siya. Dala pala yung strap niya. So, meron siyang um, ganitong strap na parang Marc Jacobs ang style. And meron siyang leather strap. Hindi ko na ilalagay yung leather strap kasi matatagalan tayo. Okay, so let's just uh, try this one. Aww. Oh, turn no siya ng aking attire ngayon. ba? Diba? It's really nice. I love this bag. Sabi ko na nga ba eh, etong si Cookie overjoyed siya sa dami ng kalat dito. So, gusto ba siya makita? Masaya masaya si Cookie. Meron siyang bagong box. Okay, so, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Nalaglag siya. So, tapos na tayo sa mga bags. And now, magpunta na tayo sa mga shoes. So, like, pinapawisan ako kasi hindi ko ma-on yung aircon dahil maingay sa audio. So, mag, mag, wipe muna ako ng pawe sa mga atit kuya. Cookie. Vlogging. Come on. Let's go to the shoes. Hindi ako masyado namili ng mga sapatos kasi nag-reverberate sa isipan ko yung sinasabi sa akin parati ng father-in-law ko noon na kahit isang pares lang ng sapatos ang meron ang isang babae, ang mahalaga, may ipon siya. So since I got an MK bag, I also bought a pair of MK sneakers na... Masusuot ko kahit anong damit. Nice, right? I also got a pair of shoes for my husband that he can wear for summer. Nag-sale ang Tommy Hilfiger sa Dong De Moon. I went there with a friend. Sumama lang ako. Yung friend ko actually ang may bibilhin. Nakita ko ito and I thought, hmm, okay. Pwede itong pag-golf ni Hobby. So, I think these are gonna be comfy for him, right? I also got a pair of lady sandals from Tommy Hilfiger, but they're not for me. They're for my mom. I think she'll be so happy with these sandals. Diba? Platform shoes. You know, my mom can wear four or five inches of heels. Para siyang Spice Girls. Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Ito na yung pinakalas. Ano ka ba? Cookie, no. Gusto niyang magpunta sa paper bag. Okay, yan. Enjoy, man. Sige, sige, sige. Pasko dyan. So, lastly, kulit. Punta naman tayo.
tayo sa mga damit ngayon. I actually bought a lot of clothes from Zara and H&M. Kasi yun lang ang kaya ng budget natin. <laughs> but, I'm gonna do a separate vlog for uh, the clothes that I bought from Zara and H&M. Let's start with Massimo Dutti. Tama ba yung pronunciation ko? Correct me if my pronunciation is wrong because it's a Spanish word, right? Okay, so I just got one shirt for my husband from that shop because I'm not sure if my husband would like the feel of it. Okay naman daw, press ko siya and hindi siya makate sa katawan. So nag ng Hollister sa Lotte World Mall. Um, this is one of the shirts that I bought for my husband. It's a surfing t-shirt. I got this one also for him, the one that I'm wearing. Pero hindi niya kasha. It's too small for him. So now I'm wearing it. Pambahay ko. <laughs> I also got some things for me from Hollister. I don't really like wearing pants, but I got me a pair of tattered jeans anyway. A simple white jacket from Hollister. Parang. Okay. Medyo magulo na siya kasi nilabhan ko na sila. So, after kung uh, bumili ng mga damit, ang ginagawa ko agad ay labhan sila. I don't wear clothes straight from the shop. Ayokong mate. And I think that's advisable, especially because of the pandemic. Di mo na alam kung sino na yung nagsukat ng mga damit. This is the last item. Tumayo ako kasi nangawit ako at si Kugi ang gulo-gulo niya. Pumupunta siyang pilit dun sa paper bag. And uh, ayoko siyang madikit dito sa, sa jacket na to dahil yung balahibo niya didikit sa tela. Anyway, the last item that I'm gonna show you is from Moose Knuckles. I got my husband this Moose Knuckles parka for winter. So, diba, nag-ready na talaga ako for this year's winter. Um, now, you might ask, bakit ako bumili ng winter jacket for him sa summer? Tinitay ko talaga yung off-season sale dito sa Korea dahil ito yung time na mura ang mga, mga damit from the past season. At kapag uh, mga winter clothes, ma mahal talaga, super mahal, especially yung mga parka, mga guza, mga jackets. If you're gonna buy this na hindi siya sale, it's gonna probably cost you $1,500 to $2,000, diba? I don't wanna spend that much money. I'm happy about this purchase. I have a Moose Knuckles jacket, and it's one of my favorite winter jackets. Even if it's freaking cold, that jacket would keep me warm. Thank you for the time you've spent unboxing with me. I hope you enjoyed unboxing as much as I did. Kailangan ko na magligpet. Till next vlog, enjoy your weekend everyone. Ito yung pinakamasayang pusa ngayon. Paano ko magligpet? Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, and follow From Korea With Love on Facebook and YouTube.